really asleep? Seems to be. Why? It's all right. It's chocolate. If you'll excuse me, I need to have a little word with the driver. Eat. You'll feel better. Good luck, Professor. <laughs> Sorry? Professor Snape. Professor <laughs> Snape. Yeah. Frightens all. Only her clothes very clearly in your mind. She carries a red handbag. You don't need to hear. Marvellous! <laughs> Absolutely very, very enjoyable. He had a certain, shall we say, talent for trouble. A talent, rumour has it, he passed on to you. Can you do this? Yes. That's one nasty Dementor. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, that's not good enough, not nearly good enough. I'm sorry to hear about your broomstick. Is there no chance of fixing it? No. I'm scared, Professor. Well, I'd consider you a fool if you weren't. Eat this, it helps. It really helps. And just so you know, Harry, I think you would have given your father a run for his money. And that is saying something. Insolent little... Professor. Designed to insult anyone who tries to read it. It's, <laughs> I suspect it's a Zonko product. Nevertheless, and don't take any detours. If you do, I shall know. Severus, don't be a fool. He can't help but he's happy by Severus, be quiet! Don't fight yourself, Remus! Uh, listen to you. I've looked worse, believe me. Now, since I am no longer your teacher, I feel no guilt whatsoever about giving this back to you. You're so, blinded by hatred. I'm not. Yes, you are. Just remember, Fleur, Bill takes his stakes on the raw side now. <laughs> My husband, the Joker. It is the quality of one's convictions that determines success, not the number of followers. Who said that? Me.